Welcome to 13 Church Street, Trafalgar. I'll take you for a quick trip around the garden. The main part of the garden, it's four o'clock in the afternoon. There's the lovely oak tree. So I'm looking towards the east at the moment. There's the temporary orange fence for the chooks. Some of our plants come from Buxton that have got to be replanted. Some are getting hammered in the frosts. It's what we've started calling the Glen down there. There's Sanchez waving on his bicycle. We inherited the ride on mower, the wood chopper we bought, the wood splitter. That's where I parked the trailer. They got about four little young lambs there, and Anne Marie got them some woolen jumpers for them. So, this is walking down to the glen, back up to the house. There are so many trees and plants and over 80 different roses. Apparently, Kit Swan was very noted for her roses in the town and she used to take bunches of roses up to the post office to put on the counter for people to use, to take. Sorry about the jerkiness. This all needs to be cleaned up a bit. A lot of the trees are, are fairly um, overgrown. They need trimming back. But at one stage you could tell it used to be stunning. Little chair I put there, made that at Buxton. It's just a lovely view, especially in the morning with the sun rising behind me now and cracking through to the house. The fallen tree we're going to be cutting up for firewood. fallen autumn leaves and then down to the corner and back up through the trees it's really lovely now this is across from the other side the back of the house Chooks are saying hello to me. Hey, yeah, Crispy. This is where we want to put the slab for the garage. It's going to pop in there. And those pegs you can see down through to the end of the bushes there. Quickly take you down through here. There's water pipes everywhere. There's about seven taps and water pipes. And we are to the back of the shed. We have regular visitors of neighbours' chooks. Lovely little cat called Prince from across the road. Whenever they go out, he comes across. The Saturday we moved in, he spent about an hour here and everyone was cooing. That's the back corner of the long room, the great hall. <laughs> Down through to the fence line. And more roses, and more roses. The 
There's the back of the house. It's a beautiful room, that. It's got all our stuff in it, but when it's sorted out as the craft room, it's going to be really nice. So many plants that are just way overgrown. But I've got a nice hefty trimmer. And back to the front door. Gorgeous views. Got the wind farm up on the hill there. Doesn't worry me. And down the side path. <laughs> 